Alright, good morning guys. I'm going to do another video blog again. Lexi wanted to show you what another day in the life of clinic is. Um, last time our video didn't include any IV chemo. It was just a monthly checkup and then we filled her daily oral chemo meds for the month. Um, this time it's a little different. Um, she'll get IV chemo through her port as well as um, they're going to sedate her and give her a lumbar puncture where they pull out a sample of spinal fluid to make sure it still has no cancer cells and then they're going to deliver a chemotherapy called methotrexate into her spinal fluid to help keep the cancer cells out of there. Um, we have to get on the road. I'm all packed up. So I will see you at the hospital. So we made it to the hospital. We're in the parking garage. I am going to hand the phone over to Lexi because it is time to put on her numbing cream so that the, her port site will be numb by the time we get to the clinic for access. So Lexi, are you ready to show everybody how brave and strong you are? Mm -hmm. I got my baby Yoda today. You brought your baby Yoda today? Yeah, it's finally coming to me. Oh, yeah. Alright, All right, so here we go. You're going to hold the camera and show it on you. So that way they can see how we put your creamy on. Okay? You ready, kiddo? You ready to put your creamy on? Hopefully, it doesn't all decide to pop out like it did last time. Okay, here we go. You're good. plastic thing so I don't get over my of my body. That's right. So the plastic thing, this is glad press and seal and it keeps it from getting on your clothes or anywhere else because we only want that spot to be numb, don't we? Mm. All right. That went a lot quicker. She's gotten better at that over time. So she and I are going to mask up and uh, get situated in the wagon and we'll see you inside the hospital. Yes, oncology clinic, Alexia Garner, Mom, Jenna, her oh. mom. Um, we got our list down there. I'm sorry. I'm just gonna get a temperature. Coughs, fevers, muscle, nope. and body aches, nope. and anybody. There's a list. You got hers out. You got it. Yeah. Let's get quick temperatures. Lexi, I bet you last name. Garner. Garner. Yep. I see you on the list. All right, and then pink stickers for both of you. Okay. Okay. You like pink stickers, don't you? Thank you, ladies. Have a good one. You too. All right, we got to get our other sticker now, Lexi. Hello. Uh, floor nine oncology clinic. Okay. 
Thank you very much. Thank you. got both our stickers they took our temperatures this time only one adult is allowed with Lexi in the building so they gave us a pink sticker that says we're allowed to be in the building and then I got my usual sticker for floor 9 that says we can go to the oncology clinic so we'll see you upstairs we are on the ninth floor Headed to Sight My Kids. This is the oncology floor clinic. Hi. Hello. Time to get your vitals, kiddo. Well, yes, the toy when you're all done. Yeah. All right. Take your shoes off for me. No, the toy's been, you know, just Oh, well, we'll see. Okay. Too shabby. <laughs> oh, yeah. She's at that stage where she likes to repeat everything we say. Mm. That could be the fun thing. stage. <laughs> There's days where she'll do it all afternoon, and I'm like, oh, please. today oh you know what we still have our Easter set on actually I need to change them out we're gonna put on some sparkly stuff for Mother's Day or maybe some flowers but yeah we still had our Easter sets on I have so many old sets that are not even available anymore because when this company when I first discovered it like, uh -huh. I bought a whole bunch oh yeah like I oh yeah and I they're just continuing stuff all the time yeah and then I, they come out with a new one. I'm like, go out and buy four more sets. Right. And, like, this is, like, from last oh, year. Oh, that's cute. It's called Going Bandanas. That's <laughs> awesome. I remember that because, it, yeah, that's really cute. So we save ours, like the ones we don't use, and I put them back in the plastic, and I use my hair straightener to seal it. Yeah, that's And it I doesn't do. mess up my hair straightener either. It's wonderful. Yeah. Because I didn't do that before, and I noticed I'd go to put them on, I'd have to use the hair dryer or something to kind of heat them up because they were kind of stiff. Uh -huh. But since using the hair straightener to seal it up, I haven't had that issue anymore. Yeah. Well, there, I, I don't know how I, um, hey, sweetie, I'm going to have you sit back and we're going to try that blood pressure one more time. Okay. Um, yeah, what I was doing, I wasn't closing them back up with a hair straightener and they would get dry on me mm -hmm. and then I would just throw them out Yep, because I didn't know what to do with them. I the the hair dryer worked somewhat to kind of like reheat that sticky but it wasn't the greatest but once I started sealing them back up I didn't have that issue anymore so yeah hold real still okay you're trying to get your blood pressure we may have to roll your sleeve up I don't know hold it still Good job. Oh, that's better. Oh, good. Yeah, she was kind of sitting off the edge there, which is kind of yeah. odd, so maybe yeah, that's I fine. Think it, 
when their legs dangle like that. Yeah. Yeah, we have, I want the boy to just will not sit on the chair. Oh. Well, that's all right. If it comes off your ear, it's tied in the back, too, since it's just a tiny tad big for you. So, you know the drill. Good job. Thank you. Wow. 12.2, we'll take it. How about I go all the way to get bigger soon? Right? All right. When you get bigger and bigger and bigger. Hey, turn around. Put your back up against here. Ninety-four centimeters. Three foot one. You're four. You did. She just had a birthday, April sixth. You're right there. Ninety-four centimeters. Wow. Yeah, I got a mom. It is. All right, we're gonna have to go to our spot and then we'll put your shoes on, okay? Since you're wearing your grippy socks. We gotta wait and see where we're gonna be, okay? We're gonna go this direction. Maria's gonna be her nurse today. All right. Here we are. Number right here. And she's got cream on her Thank plate, right? Yes, ma'am. As I run into everything. All right, get situated. So we couldn't find any ducktail figurines because you know that show is older than dirt. The age of me and my husband. So he went on eBay and was able to find somebody that was selling ducktails Legos. Because <laughs> he, lo we started watching the old version ducktails, not the new ones from like 2017. On Disney Plus, they have like all Ducktales oh, ever created, and she loves it. She can sing the whole song, so. I love it. All right, girlfriend, will you stay really still for me when we play? With all right, your can ducktails? you lean back? All right, grab what you're gonna grab, okay, and then lean back. All right, so we you gotta. Can hold them. And look, you're gonna show everybody how brave and strong you are. Uh, She's gonna put your tube in, okay? I'm Uncle Scrooge. Okay. Well, baby, I don't know where Uncle Scrooge's hat is right now, so but you need to lean back. All right. It might be that Uncle Scrooge's hat fell off at home because I don't see it in this bag, sweetie. Oh. So we'll have to ask Daddy. We gotta see, okay? Well, well Uncle Scrooge's hat is not in the bag. Oh no, Our, it probably fell off. Well, we're gonna have to, you'll have to find him his hat when you get home. Yeah. His head's gonna be cold, right? Yep, so make sure you lean your chin way back. There you go, good job. Clean, clean, clean. Clean, clean, clean. Yep. Oh, just careful with your hands, good girl. You gotta lean your chin back, all right? So lift your chin up, because you're wearing that mask. There you go. I know, it's hard. Good girl. This mask is different than her, her one last time. It's an extra small, but it doesn't have this breathable okay. filter that We're she almost likes. Done, okay. So this one's a small, so I had to use a oh. shoelace, like a clean shoelace, and tie it around the back in case it pops off her ears. There you go. Because she's kind of in dry, that okay? in-between stage where her head's not quite big enough to fill this out, even sure. with the adjustable straps, but the other one, it didn't have, they don't put them on the toddler ones. So she, you know, yeah. that, you know, all that stuff gets caught in there and it's hard to breathe and she's... What? She really wants to play with those toys that are over there, but we don't have time right now because we're going to go downstairs for an LP, no, okay? we got to make sure those toys aren't dirty. Yeah, that's the other thing. That's why we brought our own toys, because remember how Mommy's been telling you that there's a big germ floating around out there? Up. All right, here she goes. It's okay. It's okay. Wait, you're okay. Here, lift your chin you're up. It's okay. my fingers, okay? Shh, shh, okay. Shh, it's all right. It's all right. Good job. You're strong and brave. Oh, you did it. Look, you did it. You did it. Good job. You did good, baby. You did good. Hand. Now she's just going to, here, oh, calm down. Okay. She's okay. just going to put your, your sticker, sticker on, on okay? okay? Will you look up so I don't get your chin with so your you sticker? Look. Up, 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 up. Good job. And we got it on video. Oh, hold still, hold still, hold still. Look, up. Girl. look way up, up, up. Good girl, good girl. Yay. And then I know we got to come back upstairs. Because I know there's no way we can get a two-hour pentamidine infusion done yes, before 9.30. Yeah, I didn't know you had pentam today. I was like, oh, we can get Ben Christine, but we'll wait. 
see, we'll see what we can get done before, okay? We don't have to be, yeah, we don't have to be downstairs till 9.30 at registration. I think we're first on the docket for LPs, okay. which is okay. nice that she's so young, she can go yeah. first. Yeah, that's really nice. <laughs> okay. Just putting your pair of pants on. Remember last how you did that? Time. Like last time. Last time. Remember last time you found your pair of pants? Yeah. No. You don't? These are your pants. But those are not pants. I know. <laughs> that's call what they call them, use. No, these are. Those are your pants. Uh-huh. Hold still Hold for still, her. still, okay. She's trying to get that sticker the best she can, all right? Which I'm sure is hard to do with those lovely gloves. I know. <laughs> I'm going to put one more piece on, okay? Yeah, because we got to go downstairs and everywhere else. So she just wants to make sure the sticker's on really good, all right? Make sure you lift your chin up in case she needs to put one up there. Look up. Look. See how what color our ceiling is today? What color is it? Can you Look, tell me? I missed the book. Oh. Because it, well, because it was broken. Because it was broken? Oh. Is that one of the DuckTales books? Yeah. Gotcha. Uh, They're going to get a little bit of Lexi juice, okay? Because they just need to see where your numbers are at since the lab had a little bit of trouble last time. And you know, I didn't say anything because that's our favorite phlebotomist at that lab, and she always does a great job. Yeah. And when it was coming out slow, that was kind of, should have been my red it's flag because okay I know if it can. comes out slow, but I thought maybe oh. it was good enough and it would be okay. Right. So. And sometimes you can run it. I mean, so if you get it fast enough. Yeah, and not even, I mean, sometimes they just, I've had really clotted specimens and they can still pull off like a white blood. Okay. Okay. So you can go see the doctor while we're waiting on your ANC. Oh, how are you? Oh, she'll, she can get it for you. We're going to go to room F. Oh. Room F. Room F. You're four. F is for four. All right, follow her. You don't have to stop here this time. Remember, we already did that on the other side. <laughs> We're going to come in here. Good job. All right. Uh, let Dr. Bot know you're in here. Thank you. You're welcome. You want to sit down? She's just going to hang that, and then she's going to attach the other end to your tubi. And that's your vincristine chemo. So they're getting ready to hang her bag of vincristine and they have to have two nurses to verify because, you know, chemo is considered really toxic. So they make sure that it's the right medication going to the right kid and it's the right dosage for her age, height, and weight. Nice. All right, she's gonna clean your tubi. Clean, clean, clean. Yoda? Clean, clean, clean. Can I scan your bracelet? Good. Yeah. All right, she's gonna run a little stuff through it, okay, to make sure it's nice and clean. All right. So this infusion itself only takes about five minutes because it's a small amount of Christine since she's tiny.
Can she look at your armband, Lexi? Yeah. I like your unicorn shirt. Yeah. Show her your bracelet. Show her your white bracelet. Is it loud? Mm -hmm. Good job. All right, thank you. We have this Alexi Gardner. Thank you. 209-265-5296. Okay. Good job. All right, so they just verified everything, they type it in the computer, and the drip's going to start. She finished up her Vin Christine and they have locked her port. And we are going to head downstairs to floor one. That is where registration is for her LP. Yeah. And here we are on the first floor. Looks like they've got a new way they want you to get to the pharmacy, which is good to know. They must have closed off that other part. There's the ball display that she likes to watch. Gift shop is still closed. And here is the fish tank. So we can go sign in right here at registration. You wanna stay right here while mommy signs in, okay? Hello. Uh, Alexia Garner, she's here for a lumbar puncture chemo. Ready, Alexi? Time to head down to the procedure center, okay? And mom, I have an allergy to bank. Anything else? Nope, that's it. Just Red Man's for that. Perfect. And when was the last time she had anything to eat or drink? Not since last night before 7 o'clock, actually. Perfect. And did you give her any Zofran this morning? I know they said they didn't give her any in clinic. No, we did not give her Zofran this morning because oh. we would have had to use water and it's just... I, I understand Don't want to have to take the water away, so... Right, exactly. Even though it was before 7.30, that. so... That's perfect. We will I don't just give know. her some before her procedure, then. Gotcha. In the IV. You know, I didn't even think to ask about it, but if you can do it in the IV, no big. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. That is not a problem at all. And then what's a good cell phone number for you, Mom, when we're done? Uh, 618-979-0372. Perfect. Dang mask. I sound like I'm out of breath. I know. <laughs> it's like, I'm not out of breath, really, I right. promise. But... All right, kiddo, we're almost there. Doing great. It's always good to see. All right. Here we are, Lexi. Home sweet home for a little bit. All right, let's get you all situated in the bed, okay? Don't know if you can hear the background, but Lexi is here in the bed waiting to go back for her LP. And they are playing um, the movie Frozen for her. She got to pick from a list of movies on the TV. So basically, 
it was pretty quick upstairs in clinic because Van Christine only takes five minutes. And we got her new CBC back. The ANC still isn't back, but their main concern was her platelets, and uh, her platelets were in the 200s. So that's how we're able to proceed with the uh, LP today. So we got down here to registration at 9.30 like we were supposed to, and our um, LP doesn't start until 10.30, and I don't know if you can see the clock behind me, but it's almost 10 o'clock now. So we have another half an hour to wait down here, and this poor kiddo is hungry, or should I say hangry. Unfortunately, she cannot eat or drink until after the procedure, so... We are just trying to find things to pass the time. Do you want to say hi, Lexi? You want to say hi? She is like glued to the TV screen watching her movie. She loves Frozen. So we will check in with you guys later when it's finally time to go down the hall to the procedure room for the LP. Here we are. I'm right here, okay? Don't worry. We're just going to go down the hall, okay? And then once we get in there and everyone's all masked and gowned up, they'll take your mask off so they can get you ready to go, okay? Did you tell them what you did for your birthday? We got to, after labs that day, we got to go on an animal hunt through the neighborhood in our car. All our friends put stuffed animals in the windows for her. Did you find a bunch of them? You what found lots of animals, didn't you, Lexi? What's your favorite one? <laughs> they sound like they're talking underwater. <laughs> All right, you okay, kiddo? You wanna hold my hand? And let's show them where your tubies hanging out at, okay? They wanna see where your tubies hanging out. They'll need that. There we go. That's pretty awesome shirt when you've got a tubie to deal with, right? Yeah. Is that what it's meant for, or is it? Uh huh. Yeah, we had somebody make them. A lady oh, from my church, so and then my cool. mom tweaked them a bit. Oh. That's awesome. I'm gonna scan your bracelet first, okay? That's the one I've from Clinic. Clinic, if so. it doesn't work, I have our other one here. Oh, oh there you go. I mean, it's just, it's just like an identifier, so. Oh, that's fine. Sometimes it's awesome, sometimes it's not that. Oh, okay, can I set your head back? Woo! Down you go. It's okay, you're all right. I'm right here. It's I'm okay. right here. Thank you, Dad. It's, here, yeah, I did. Can I okay. pick you up and put you up higher on the pillow? Yeah, okay, one, two, three, there we go. That way we can meet you a little bit better. I love and your now, baby Yoda. You yeah. You need to, to and maybe clean you have this. To flush the stop or no? I just have to open. I did. I can grab one. And then they're going to give you the medicine to keep you from throwing up. They're going to give you the Zofran in your IV, okay? That's right, when you're sleeping. Well, I think that'd be in my TV. It'll be in your tubi. Instead of having to take it in your mouth, because you don't always like the taste of it anyway, they can just give it in your tubi this time. Your Zofran? You need the Zofran still? Yes. Okay. Oh, my. Who is on your blanket? Is that Paw Patrol? Okay. Can I put a sticker on your finger? It's working. There we go. The Yay! Sleepy Time White Medicine. Can I put a sticker on your finger? Look at her adorable Look at those nails. cute nails. all at once, huh? Are we overwhelming you, sweetie? Okay. It's okay. I'm right here. Really I'm nice. right here. You're all right. Good job, Lexi. Very good job. She's gone. <laughs> I think so. Oh, You're out, your kiddo. Finger. What a cute little mask. Yeah. Oh. It's an N99. <laughs> okay. So You're all right. Shh, 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 shh. Settle down. It's okay. Shh. It's all right. I'm right here. It's okay. It's okay. There All righty. All righty. Do you know where to go, Mom? Yep, sure do. Okay. Thank you. All right, Mom. I'll give you a call here shortly. All right. Okay. Normally, they just let me out this door if you don't mind. <laughs> so, it's just quicker. Thank you. All right. So, they let me out. And now I am going to go back the other way and head 
went down to the pharmacy. It's always a mad dash to get to the pharmacy while she's under for the LP. And hopefully they'll have the medication in time because then we can avoid coming back to the pharmacy and we can actually just leave from upstairs or from whenever we're done. So there's a new way to get to the pharmacy. Normally you would just go down past registration like I did the last time, but I guess they've got that all closed off now and don't even have it manned. So you have to walk through. This is actually straight ahead, the pharmacy. And this zebra is actually, that direction is actually where you enter from the ER. So Lexi recognizes that zebra every time we go inpatient. So I am gonna grab our meds, hopefully they're done, and then go wait out in the waiting area. So I'm now down in the waiting area next to the ball pit. Um, while they're doing the LP. Unfortunately, it was gonna be another 25 minutes on the meds from the pharmacy. So I don't know if I'm gonna have time to get those before her LP is done. Depends on how long they take, if they had any issues like they did last time, they had that breathing issue. Um, and then they'll call me back fairly soon when she starts to wake up. She has to lay flat on her back for a half an hour after the LP. Something to do with your spinal fluid and because it's an LP and everything, there's like certain requirements. And that's why we have the wagon on LP days because they don't want her walking all over the place after having general anesthesia. They won't let her walk out. so. That way we can have her in the wagon. So I will be stuck waiting here. It is deserted. There is not one other person in this waiting area. And usually it's pretty packed. The whole hospital is pretty empty actually. So it makes me feel a little better knowing that I'm just here by myself and nobody else around me. So I might feel comfortable to take off my mask and take a swig of my tea or something, so. I will check in with you guys once she wakes up from her LP. So they just called me and said that Lexi is done. So that means that she has laid down her requisite amount of time and she's starting to stir away from the anesthesia. So I am headed back down to the procedure center, back to our room, so I can be there for when she wakes up. Twice gone back to sleep, so since okay. her half an hour wasn't up, I right, right, let her sleep. Sure, all right, kiddo. Is there anything in particular she likes to eat or drink when she wakes up from here? Um, we've got her cup of water, and then I brought a bunch of her snacks. She just likes Perfect. goldfish and stuff, so I'll let her eat a little bit, and then we'll put the mask on to go back upstairs, and then she can eat once we're safely in the clinic. Perfect. She can eat some more. I will go get her a glass of ice water. We've got her cup you got, here. You got her she cup? likes her Perfect. straw cup. She's particular. <laughs> I I don't blame her. I, I was just gonna say I have a two year old that is the most particular child I've ever met in my life. So I she likes the, a certain kind of straw cups are her favorite. So, although I will say she does like the she won't drink milk, but if we're inpatient, she likes it in the carton. <laughs> oh, that's fine. She'll sometimes drink like a swig here or there and be like, oh, yummy. <laughs> Because it's in the carton, but if right. you try to pour it into her cup, she says it doesn't taste good, so. Oh, that is too funny. Girl, it knows what she wants. I Pretty much. Her. Well, she used to drink milk all the time, and then her taste buds really changed, so. Yeah. She stopped not wanting it, so we just try to do lots of vegetables that have good calcium in them right. and hope for the best. on your arm, and then I'll leave you alone, okay? You waking up? Hey, it's all right. I'm right here. I'm right here. Okay, I'm right here. I'm right here. 
Are you going back to sleep? No. Yeah. Are you going to stay awake? So, do you think you might want a sip of water? And you're hungry. Okay, so what if we get, would you eat a little goldfish in your belly? Do snacks? Oh, I do have fruit snacks. If you have fruit snacks, that's fine. Okay. I already got it off. <laughs> it's all gone. We'll get you all unhooked. Good job. So. Are you still sleepy? No. no. You had a good nap? Did you have any funny dreams? No. No. You had a nap? All right. Here you is. You had a good nap. Do you want me here? No, just lay back and I'll go ahead and raise your thing up, okay? That way. Whoops. Here, just sit up. No, no, no. Just lay back. I was excited when my baby Yoda from Oh, okay. Does anything hurt right now, Miss Lexi? Do you have any owies? No. No? Perfect. All right, go ahead and take a swig of your sip of your water. And let me grab the uh, bag of fruit snacks, okay? Does that taste good? Mm. All right. You ready for some fruit snacks? There you go. Let me go get your discharge orders. You can have some little fruit snacks, and then we'll get you going here shortly, okay? All righty, sounds good. So we're going to let Lexi eat some fruit snacks and sip on some water. We don't want to go overboard because if you try to feed them too much out of the gate on an empty stomach with anesthesia, we've learned the hard way in the past that she can throw up. So we just let her eat a little bit at a time and sip on the water. And then they'll get us the discharge papers, and we will head back upstairs to floor nine. So we will catch you in a little bit. So we are leaving the procedure center. Lexi is all done with the LP. She woke up, got a couple of bags of fruit snacks in her tummy, and a little few sips of water. So that'll last her and let her settle in her stomach. And then once we get upstairs to clinic, she can have some more. So since we're on the way back to clinic, I'm gonna try to swing by the pharmacy and see if perhaps her meds are ready again. Because we would like to avoid having to go back downstairs when we're done at the end of the day so that way we can just leave and they always give me an ice pack anyway for the ones that need refrigeration so shouldn't be a big deal so hopefully they got them done now we'll find out so we got Lexi's meds for the month slowly but surely the price is going down um, it used to be a thousand dollars and then it crept down to $800, and now it's $574 for, and all we were getting was her normal two monthly chemo, so the one that she takes every Wednesday and the one that she takes every day, and then we also had to get a week's worth of Dex pills, and then we needed a refill on her Zofran and her Pepsid, as those have expired. We're back, headed back to Hemonk, to the infusion center. Are we back?
back in the same chair as before? Hi. Um, we were in four. Yeah, okay. All right. Hello. You ready, kiddo? You're back. Yep. All we got left is that pesky pentamidine. We're gonna sit over here this time. Visit. Good boy. What? He liked you? Yeah, yeah you can pet him. You want to scoot forward and pet him? Yeah, all right, pup. Let's go. Here. There you go. Aww. Look at his tail wagging. Yeah, he likes you. Hi there. Hi there. What? What'd you, you say his name was again? Casey. Casey, that's right. Hi, Casey. You're pretty. Do you like his ears? They're very soft. Yeah, such a good boy. Look at that. What do you think? Do you like the doggy? He's a little bit bigger than our doggies at home, isn't he? Good job. Aww. He laid down there. He must be tired. What do you think? Do you want to get down and pet him? Yeah. Lexi's coming to say hi again. Here, I got you. Don't worry. You can, you want to go down? keep petting him? I think she's a little wobbly from the anesthesia, yeah. so I'll use my knee. And there you go. You can lean forward and pet him if you want. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. And who's back there? Good job. You like dogs, don't you? Can you tell him thank you for bringing his doggy? You're welcome. Thanks for playing with him. Yeah. Do you remember his name? It's Casey. Casey, that's right. Such a pretty dog. Yep, it's cold. Job. It is cold. You're right. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah, I think you're giggling. <laughs> Just happened. Good job. job. Making sure it gets to all the right places. Yeah. Right. Leave in. your chin way up, okay? Look up here. <gasps> Do you see his fingers? Where's his fingers? Oh, here we go. Mr. Oh, Avocado. look. Look. What is that? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You got Yoda. You got Yoda. What's he doing Look up how there? Happy this avocado I don't know. Is. An avocado? What's wrong? Oh, I don't know. Do you like avocados? It's okay. I've it's never a... tried one. You've never tried an You've avocado. Tried you know what? You had avocado when you were a little bitty baby. Oh, uh, look at that. Do you like cupcakes? Yeah. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. Kind of Hold my hand. It's like? okay. Just squeeze my hand. Do you like? Chocolate or vanilla cupcakes? Go ahead. I bet you vanilla. vanilla. Yeah. Uh, oh sprinkles? boy. Um, <gasps> Look at that. Do you like sprinkles on your cupcakes? Yeah. You do? Yeah. All right. Good job. Me too. Good job. Sprinkles and vanilla icing. That sounds yummy, yeah. delicious. It's oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Shh, shh, shh. All right. It's this all right. It's been on there a little longer this time. This you, we've been here a long time, so it's been here a bit. Oh my goodness! You're done. Look. You're a champ. All right. Banded. Yep. She likes. Oh, it wants to stick to her gloves. There you go. You did it, Lexi. Yeah. Good job. We are finally able to leave clinic and go home. It's now two thirty. And it'll take us another 45 minutes to get home. So we left the house about 6.45 and we won't get home until uh, close to four. So it makes for a long day. 
Well, we finally made it to the car. Don't know. You can see all the lines on my face from my mask. I look terrible. I basically... Lexi is back there also. She had a mask on, but hers is a little more forgiving because it's a toddler N99 mask. Um, so it's been a long day. We finally got Lexi's A and C back um, from the other labs. Hemoglobin was great. Blood, white blood cells are, are what they are. But her A and C was actually at 1400, which is like on the top end of where they want her to be between, um, you know, 750 and 1500. But again, she's only on 50% of her chemo dose until now. So they felt comfortable because her ANC was so high, upping her chemo dose to 75% of what it's supposed to be. And then hopefully when we go ne back next month, if she's still holding strong, she can finally get back up to 100% dosage. And we'd like to be able to at least be at 100% dosage through the end of her treatment, which ends in October. So that's the goal. Um... We did not get to see our regular fellow. She's our oncologist, Dr. Zimmerman. Um, they're kind of um, trying to limit the amount of people in the hospital. So they've been having the fellows work from home and take care of all the on-call things at night. I'm sure that's fun. And uh, we saw a nurse practitioner that we had never seen before. So Lexi was a little um, nervous and shy around her, which is understandable. Somebody new, you know, that's late in the game. But what are you going to do? She took it in stride, and overall, it was an okay day, just really long. <laughs> so, um, I hope you all are staying safe out there, and uh, just, yeah, everybody stay safe, and um, hopefully we'll be able to um, get our lives back to normal at some point. Um, but Lexi and I... We'll be staying home and staying inside and not going anywhere. Except for the hospital and, you know, lab. So, thank you all for your support. We love you so much. Oh, goodness. My brain is, like, fried from today. So, anyhow, thank you so much for your support. Um, we are going to hit the road.